Hello everyone, this is Insane Kicks bringing you a... Uh, today is a brand new thing. Today I'm bringing you the new iOS 6 jailbreak for the iPod Touch 5th generation, iPad mini, and all the newest devices. I know this this newest jailbreak came out on Sunday, but I've seen a lot of people post videos so you would say, oh, why should I watch yours? Well. You see videos on YouTube are displayed to everyone differently depending on who you're subscribed to. And if you're subscribed to me, well, you'll get to see this video and maybe others will too. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, today I will be using the iPod Touch 5th generation, which you might be able to see right here. This is the... This is the red special edition one. It is my sister's, not mine. So let's get started here, like I said. Okay, first you have to go to the link I provide in the description. Then you scroll down to the bottom. And depending on what you have, if you have the Windows, Macs, or Linux, I have Windows, so you go to evasion.exe, should load like that. You check this little box over here, and then you click download. Once it completes, you should see it right here. And let's extract this. Extract all files here. I'm extract it to the same place. Okay, so there it is. Evasion. You will see this second one right here. This is the one you want to click. Just put yes or run as administrator in the first place. I have connected it to the computer as you can see. So now on the screen it says iPod Touch. It recognized it. So now we so now now to start we'll just click on the jailbreak button and then we let the process begin. This is going to take a little bit of time, so if I do, I might have to pause the video and then start again later, or I'll just leave the whole thing to start to go. As you can see on the iPod Touch, nothing's really happening right now. By the way, like I said, this is my sister's iPod, it's not mine. So for now, we just wait. As you can see later on, it says waiting for the device to reboot the not touch your device. And on your screen, on your iPod touch or iPhone 5 screen, it should say, it should be loading up. Now oh, it's in step two. It still says do not touch your device, so just leave it alone. As you can see on screen right now, it says uploading Cydia. And remember, this jailbreak works for 6.0 to 6.1 anything in between as well this is officially for every single device thanks to evasion for this we have been waiting for this for a long time and I know they worked really hard on it so 
if you can support them on PayPal. Um, let them know how well they did. It did take a while, but it should all be worth it now. The wait is over. As you can see on the screen right now, it says to continue, please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon. Only tap it once. The screen will go black and then return to the home screen. Okay, so we should do that right now. On. Slide it. You can see it right there if I can get it to focus. Jailbreak button. It says to tap it once. Screen should go black. And then now it's continuing on the computer. So I guess that's the whole process for that. It's injecting the final jailbreak data. And there you go. Success. Jailbreak is now complete. The device may restart a few times as it competes as it completes the process. And surely enough on the screen, you see it restarting. There you saw it restart once more after the evasion logo came on again initializing offsets you can't really see the little letters on the bottom but that's what it says finding offset cleaning up i'm using an iphone 3gs to record the screen so that's not the best camera in the world i apologize right now there you go it says done continuing boot Right now I am sick, so sorry if my voice sounds weird. Um, it always sounds weird anyway, but yeah. Um, I just decided to put this video up to see what, who would get to watch this video and stuff like that. Okay, so now it looks like it finishes, so we're gonna slide to unlock. Surely enough, here on the top, you should see Cydia. And let's try opening it up. Let's see if it opens because they claim that it has been crashing because a lot of people are trying to connect to it at the same time. So there's like an overload going on, but we'll see. Is this the first? This is the first time we're going to it, so it's preparing file system. And then it says Cydia will exit when complete. I guess we're going to have to reopen it again. Okay, not only did it close the app, but it restarted the whole iPod process. Okay, so we should go to Cydia one more time. And then use, if you're just a user, hacker, or developer, I'm just a user, so. User, done. And there we go, Cydia is now working. I have, we have 
to prove this is the red version of the iPod Touch. It has the camera and the flash and the little thing on the bottom. So you cannot lie. This is officially working. You can search, manage, everything. And it seems to be quite fast actually. Let's see. Let's go down to the bottom. For example, Dreamboard. This is incredible. This is really fast. So yeah, as you guys saw, it does work. It does work, and uh, if this gets enough views, because I know a lot of people are posting these types of videos online right now, but if that if it does get enough views, you can ask me any questions on the bottom of the comment. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. As always, if you have any questions, just let me know. In the future, I'll be posting up some new add-ons and stuff that I like about Cydia. Um, new customizations and all that good stuff tweaks so if you're looking forward to more videos in the future please comment rate and subscribe and let me know what i can do but until then this has been insane kicks with an iphone with an ipod touch fifth generation jailbreak until next time bye